Welcome to our five on five. We're previewing the big red, white and boom celebration with Brad Hicks, the president and CEO of the Medford Jackson County Chamber of Commerce and DJ Veach, also known as David Veach, <laughs> MCing and DJing the event. Gentlemen, thanks for being here today. Thanks for, thanks having, for us. having us. All right. So, Brad, let me start with you. Biggest, best yet. What are you most excited about? Well, um, I mean, I'm always excited about the thing. I love fireworks. I love community you know? celebrate. I mean, how, how do you not <laughs> like fireworks? <laughs> right? It's America. Uh, somewhere John, John Adams is smiling <laughs> down on us. Um, but this year, uh, in addition to the City of Central Point, who is our presenting sponsor, and Red Robin, our title sponsor, uh, Lithia for Kids joined us as a sponsor, and they are sponsoring the kids area. Mm. And we always wanted to really beef up the uh, the activities for the children mm -hmm. and uh, it's going to be cool we've got bounce houses and laser tag and and face painting and you name it yeah uh, very family friendly of ice course. cream it's July 4th you gotta have, gotta bring the whole family yeah I mean we we really want this to be um, Southern Oregon's backyard Fourth mm -hmm. of July barbecue. Yeah, and it's Just the biggest celebration, of course, in Southern Oregon, one of the largest in the state. Yeah. So, so David, let me ask you about the fireworks. What can people expect with that, and exactly what time, if you if you know? Is well, that? fireworks are going to be starting <laughs> at dark. Okay. Uh, so we don't it's a have good a time good enough. Yeah. Right. <laughs> we don't have a specific time. We're estimating maybe around ten, but uh, not sure exactly. Uh, it's going to depend on uh, a few factors. Sure. Um, but fireworks are going to start at dark, and it's going to be the biggest uh, that we've ever had here. And it's one of the biggest in the state of Oregon, and uh, it's fantastic. It's yeah. always a blast. Okay, Pardon the pun. Yeah, sure. And, and you're emceeing and DJing the event. Yes. What kind of music can people expect? Lots and lots of stuff. Uh, there's a lot of variety. So I'm going to start off. We're going to be uh, I'm going to be out there DJing some music. So just a a variety of different uh, types of music that are everyone's going to enjoy. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to transition over to uh, Hunter and the Dirty Jacks. Uh, they play a little bit more rock and roll type music. And then we're going to um, have our local band from Grants Pass, Functional Fusion, and they play an amazing set. They've done a lot of performances around the area and always a, always a crowd pleaser. Very, very popular. All right. Sounds like a great time. We're going to take a quick break. have much more in a moment. Stay with us. Welcome back to our Five on Five. We're going to be here with Brad Hicks and David Veach. We're talking about Red, White, and Boom coming up just next week. Next Tuesday as July 4th is creeping up quickly, gentlemen. So, uh, Brad, let me start with you. It sounds like we're expecting more people than ever this year. I think it's a real possibility. We always have huge crowds, but um, this year uh, it's my understanding that Grants Pass and Josephine County will not have a fireworks display. So we're expecting, uh, you know, we always say it's a, it's a Southern Oregon event. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, so uh, we're expecting folks from Grants Pass to come over maybe in mass uh, mm -hmm. more than they have in the past. So uh, I hope they do. Uh, they're more than welcome. But it's a good uh, it's a good reason to get there early and mm -hmm. and you know uh, spot your yeah. your uh, location on the grass. <laughs> yeah, and yeah, yeah. And, 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 and obviously you guys, David, are you know as MC and, and uh, DJing the event, you know you know you guys are tailoring it so that people don't need to rush out because it's, it's just crazy. Thousands of people show up for this thing. Yeah. Absolutely, yeah. Uh, gates are going to open at uh, five thirty. So we encourage people to get there around that time, uh, start lo finding their location on the lawn where they're going to mm -hmm. hang out. Um, and then after the fireworks display, we're going to bring Functional Fusion back out on stage to play another set just to give people something to do. If they don't want to make a rush for their car and try and you know, get tied up in the traffic on yeah. the way out, they can sit around and enjoy. Okay. Uh, so it's really intended to be a whole afternoon and evening uh, sort of event. Uh, you know, show up at 5.30. Spend some time in the Lithia for Kids area with your family, having some fun. And get that exercise out. Got to Absolutely. Yeah. Visit, the, yeah, wear visit, them out. visit the food vendors and mm -hmm. uh, all that fun stuff. Visit the, we're going to have a bunch of Patriot tables out there with a bunch of community uh, partners uh, representing their businesses, not-for-profits, things like that. So mm -hmm. a lot of, lot of things for people to do out there. And, of course, still free, right? It's still free. It is a gift from chamber member businesses to the region. And, uh, you know, speaking of the region, it might be a good time to just remind people we're really fortunate in the Valley. There's a lot of great Fourth of July activities going on during the day. Mm -hmm. So Red, White and Boom doesn't have to be the only thing you do in the evening, in the afternoon. But Ashland and Eagle Point and Central Point and communities all around the Valley mm -hmm. have great parades and great activities for families yeah. all day long. This is so just you can, the nightcap. Yeah, this is the, yeah, this is the grand finale <laughs> yeah. of, of a really cool day. Yeah. All right. Absolutely. Very good, gentlemen. Thank you so much for yeah. being here. Thank uh, you. Much more in a moment. Stay with us. We'll be right back.